Booyah! Booyah! Morning from Spoon Bay. Looking pretty pretty. Steve's just gone to go get some fly piss off. It might be gone. It is looking pretty. It's terrible over there. Oh, and the flies are terrible. Absolutely terrible. There's a bit of action happening in the sky. It was a hint of sunrise a second ago, but it's gone. And there's, I can see rain in those clouds coming down. Yep. Oh, it is, yeah, it is. Just up, just up to see there. We stuck right in it because we've, we've walked a good uh, 100 yards from the, from the cars, <laughs> which is further than we normally go. Except the day we went to Whitty Bay. Yeah, which we're not going to again. No, we're never going there again, apparently. <laughs> That's been struck off the list of places to go, things to see. We've seen it. So now we're just here in the dark. Semi. Probably could make your way over that cave over there. Good cave. And that was the last they ever saw of him. <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't mind going to the rocks. They're just as easy to take off from the, from the rocks and off the yeah. sand. Yeah. <laughs> here at Spoon Bay. If you look over there, it's, uh, it's uh, filled behind me. But uh, that looks pretty good apart from the flies. We had a discussion last night on Facebook and that, that little bit of rock over there is not Wombrook Point. That bit of rock over there is Wombrook Point. And this is Spoon Bay. Probably it looks like a spoon. It looks like a spoon, so if you look from a long way up and squinted. So there's rocks here too. So, so around that point is uh, Forrester's Beach. And this is the Skillion, dwarfed by a Boca headland behind it. 5.45 in the morning, <clears throat> Sunday morning, lovely. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. We're all happy. Wombrel Beach with Wombrel Lagoon in the background. Good one, fellas. Play it again. <laughs>